How old were you when you got into skateboarding? Uh, I was really young. I'd say probably around seven or eight. Just on some little kid skateboard. Uh, I haven't really been consistently skating like I did when I was younger. Uh, I had other things to focus on like school and stuff. Um, right now it's just a hobby, but I think if I keep pushing myself, then it could become a career. It took me a while to relearn them, I guess, and figure out like foot placements and things like that. They, those are things that you gotta learn, relearn. You can't just jump back on doing things that you did before when it's been at least a year since you've skated last. I'd say I've had four or five injuries that were related to skateboarding. Um, the worst was my broken collarbone where my bone actually went down under the other side of my collarbone. Um, broken toe, broke my finger in half, um, I've sprained my ankle and I broke my wrist. Well, when I broke my collarbone, that was just, I lost control of my board going down a steep hill and just <laughs> splat. <laughs> um, when I broke my finger, I was trying a board slide on a three foot tall ledge and didn't dismount in time. <laughs> um, most, but for the most part, they were new tricks, a couple that I had known, but was trying on like something maybe higher or different. Never quit. Never let yourself feel defeated if it's something that you truly want to do. Don't let the doubt creep in. Don't let people talking bother you. If it makes you happy, push. And that's what I'm working on doing. It's it's a sense of freedom. It's helps some it, it helps people define who they are in some cases. Uh, for some people it's their entire identity. Uh, but for me personally, it's just fun. It's exciting and it gives just this awesome sense of accomplishment that words can't describe when you finally accomplish something that you've been working so hard to do.